Hey guys, how are you? Good. Hey, how are you, Joey? Hanging in the there. Same, we have the same the Jets glory fan. background. You Jets? Yeah. Fan? I am unfortunately a Jets and Mets fan. Long suffering. Yes. You know, they, I had a great buddy who is no longer with us, Mike Haggerty, and he, he was a huge Cubs fan from Chicago. You know, and and, and his, his line used to be, "Look, any club can have a bad century." You know. Yeah. No, we there is proof there. Jesus. <laughs> I, I have long talked to anytime I'm I'm dating someone or going on a date and they ask about sports, I just tell them I I don't get to be happy because of sports. So <laughs> that joy you're supposed to get, I I don't get. Um, wow. Instead of films, instead. Um, wow. I, I watched uh, watched the movie last night, and I it's so nice to see actors that you enjoy but rarely see get the screen to themselves. There's so many scenes that are just the two of you, and I I was thinking about how many times probably over the course of your career that's happened, and I mean, it, it's rarer than it should be. And I was yeah. thinking, when you're making it, are you are you thinking about that, or is it just, you know, at this point, it's nice to be working and having a good time? Well, I very much, go, 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 go. Well, I would just say, you know, for me, I've always viewed this as, you know, it's it's a two hander. It's you know, it's a, it's it's a, the two guys. And as a writer, that I I love writing that. You know, Mad About You was I would just couldn't wait to get the two of us in the kitchen. It's like, all right, here's seven pages of yeah. two idiots are going back and forth. So that's to me the fun and. You know, without any preparation or or direction, Colm and I kind of fell into a really lovely rhythm that felt um, natural and funny. And one of the things I got from, I, I don't know if I got it, but I, I came to really treasure Colm is his silences and his pauses and, so like, <laughs> and, and the rhythm. It's like in the rhythm, and rhythm isn't always talking, talking, talking. It's like, <laughs> you know, he's, oh shit, he's thinking something. <laughs> and like, Oh, and that would scare me more than whatever he was going to say. It's like, oh, I, I don't know where he's going as a character or as a as a or as an actor. Um, but those, that's it's great fun to do two handers and yeah. have have somebody who hitting the ball back as fast as you can throw it to him. Oh yeah, yeah I, you I, go, I, sir. Yeah, go for it, Colm. Well, yeah, I mean, I don't think to to, to, to your question. Um, it's certainly not something you think of when you're playing the scene. I think you you, you know we, 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 you, you you play the scene, you know whether whether it's whether you've got, you know your own you, 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 twenty scenes together or two scenes together. You, you you know you try and do the best job you can and and, and make it as interesting and funny or whatever as possible. So I, it's not something you have in your mind that uh, oh you know we are we are the uh, you know we we are the sort of core of this movie or anything like that. No. No, I mean, but, but you know, it's like that, that scene that we got to do with uh, Lucianne uh, uh, McAvoy in the hotel room. Yeah. We all, I, all three of us were looking forward to that because, like, okay, this is there's nothing but acting. This a small room and three people with very divergent goals yeah. and opinions <laughs> bumping into the. It was like three marbles in a jar, and we went, yeah. "Oh, this is going to be fun." And, yeah. like, and great, and the writing there—that's an example of how good the writing is, you know, as well. That the the uh, the three of them are 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 uh, it, 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 because because of the smaller room that it's so concentrated it's so uh, like it makes each of the each of their arguments stronger or something and that makes it funnier and more focused. Oh yeah, no, I think it's it's a credit to that. No, go, go ahead. Sorry. No, I was say watching that the other night, Colin. I was tickled by like this. Each of the three of them have such anger <laughs> at, yes. at the other two it's like oh there's no place to land here well, well, it, but, it also, but, but it also goes i'm with you against her she's with me against yes. you and, and then and then it goes like you know you and her against me and then and, and, and then we finally settle and you go yeah. yeah but i wonder why i wonder why oh my god it's not even over now he's gonna she's gonna pull this up well i think yeah when you watch it, it, it does such a good job of of keeping the the level of comedy really actor focused. Because I think you know you watch it, and I kept waiting: was it going to become broader and 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 go close to slapstick, or is it going to get more serious? And then I've seen the Banshees of Inisherin; and I don't need to see that twice. And like I think the fact that it is so character based and and relating to just like if you are it, it, it it's so easy for someone to watch this and see 
oh, this is how I interact with my friend. This is how I interact with my grandfather. It's just like you see that there's a connection of people that is obviously good writing, but I think also just the way you guys interact. I think if you swap out the actors, you have a completely different movie. Oh, that's great to hear because one of the things that struck me about the script when I first read it was that, you know, Paul got Ireland. He got what modern Ireland is about and all its diversity and all that and its modernity and its ancient stuff. But 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 um, what was exactly that was was that these uh, characters are completely believable. Yeah. You know, there isn't there isn't a moment in the script where, where I went. Eh, no, that's uh, I don't get, and and that's what makes it funny. Yeah, you know, it's the truthfulness of it that makes it funny. So, but it's lovely to hear you say that. Right, I think even just watching, you know, something that isn't necessarily going to be in every movie. Like, there's there's looks that you guys get to do. There's moments. I think even just like Paul, the times where you're peeing, you know, and just like the second it takes is like how many movies? <laughs> no, that's the well, so me up. And you know, I was on the floor I, at the screen. It tickled me. Night. It tickled me that you were laughing. So that you know, know, I, that's it. Was just and, and the, the way the, the 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 shot is framed beautifully. You know, the the frame of the door and yeah. most of your body, and you're just standing there. And it just it it cracked me up completely. Well, you know what's funny about because somebody one angry bitter reviewer said, "Hey, I'm in a peeing. What? No." Uh, why is that still funny? Oh, yes, old guys pee. I go, well, it's not about the pee. Yeah. The whole reason it was set up was like, I have a problem. I have this, yeah, I'm yeah. old enough. And he goes to Ireland, and I still have this problem. And then yeah, he doesn't have a problem because Ireland healed him. It's like, that was the problem. I'm in the wrong country. <laughs> the moon is beautiful, and I'm having an unbelievable flow here. This is the place for me. Because you love it? No, because my body just changed. <laughs> that was the whole reason the peeing joke was in there. It was like to show how molecularly uh, helpful exactly. Ireland it's was. A bonus that old guys peeing can be funny. Like it's been funny for a lot of you know. Listen. You work yeah, with it's been done. It's been done before, but you know it wasn't done gratuitously. The jo- the point of the joke was, he's healed by being in this country. Exactly, that it works on two levels is how you know you're watching a good movie. You know, because like how many times? Because okay. we've all watched bad movies and laughed and been like, you're almost annoyed at yourself. You're like, I that didn't deserve my laugh. That's a real laugh. <laughs> well, this you know it, there is there is the comedy does accelerate and it gets broader, but not because we're trying to outdo ourselves. The characters are trying out to be like, okay, you did this, I'll do, I'll raise you and I'll keep accelerating. Um, but, you know, I think what what we're seeing in the audience is responding to is you like these guys. They're not malicious. They, no. In fact, they're, they're both tr- agreed to do something uh, noble, right? right. Colm is doing, he's, he's taking care of his father. It's his father's pain in the ass, dying wish, go find your cousin in America. I don't know, okay. Mm-hmm. And make peace. And I go there and we try and we, you know, we embrace upon meeting. And then it goes bad because we're all flawed. As his colon goes, ah, we're all filthy creatures. You know, <laughs> we're, we're all, and that's the problem with people. It's like, we may be well-intended and we'd like to live in a peaceful world and an ideal, but yeah, I don't want to be the first guy to put my gun down. How about you? You go first. Okay. There it is. There's the problem. That's what I. That's why I think you guys have a good movie on your hands. Is that it? It is at its core a funny movie. Watching you know classically mismatched uh, actors, and it helps that it's actors you want to watch. But it is. It does. It spends just enough time on the serious stuff that you you have that scrolling around in your brain. And when it is more serious or when it's more comedic, it never feels out of place. It just feels like that's the moment we're in, and that's that's a oh, real great. Uh, well, that, you know, I, I gotta say that's that's the that's the good writing, you know. That's that's really it's 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 it, that's what struck me about it, you know, when I first read it as well. That it's 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 such good writing; it doesn't ever feel phony or false or or, or imposed in any way. Oh yeah, no, and it's why you guys should be uh, incredibly proud. And I was I was thrilled to do it. Just like two guys who I see in stuff all the time and like. I mean, Paul, I was too young to be watching Mad About You, but I loved it. Um, it's just funny. In the what, womb. He loved it in the womb. He said, <laughs> oh, Brooks on in the womb. So, like, it, <laughs> but it's funny to look uh, at you guys both did okay. Remington Steel. Like, you guys have done so much over the years. Did you do Remington Steel? Did you do Remington Steel? I did, yeah. That's so funny. Yeah. That was my first, that was my first 
acting job in California. I was I don't I hadn't even moved here. You have to be a waiter. <laughs> no, I didn't have to be a waiter, but I exactly. and I remember on an episode of Rams and Steel, I, 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 myself and Pierce were in in, in a scene in a bar, and uh, the, the 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 script was I, I, I turn and swing at him and give to punch him, and I said, you know, it'd be much more in, in a bar. You wouldn't really do that. It'd be much more interesting if I uh, just turned and headbutted him, you know. And uh, and and they're, oh yeah, that's great. Yeah, let's do that. So we did that. And by the time we'd shot it, like you know, uh, the master over shoulder, over shoulder, blah, 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 you know, we'd done like thirty eight takes. And mm -hmm. um, the next morning, I woke up and I couldn't move. My I couldn't speak. <laughs> my neck was like, I don't know what the fuck. We got glandular fever or something. You know what I mean? Uh, something something went really wrong with me. And then I realized it was all that uh -huh. pulling the head button. Uh, 38 times or whatever many times I did it. <laughs> That's wow. my memory of Rabbi Jim Steele. <laughs> oh, my. Of course. Of course. Yeah. Remember, remember where we got hurt. Exactly. Yeah. Thank you guys so much for doing this. Congrats. Thank you. And feel, listen, Joey, feel free to tell everybody to go see this. Don't keep it to yeah. yourself. Yeah. Yeah. My job. So I will do Thank my best. Thank, Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thanks, man. Have a good one.